The Desert Financial Credit Union Hometown Heroes Toy Drive was amazing thanks to this gentleman right here, Jeff Mishi, and his wonderful uh, staff, everybody who participated, are different partners with Desert Financial Credit Union. And Jeff, I have to say, what an amazing year again being a part of this. Three years you've been, and, and we can't say thank you enough. Yeah, no, it was great. Um, bigger than ever. I understand we gave away over 10,000 toys. Yeah. Year. That's a lot of toys. That's a lot of toys. But it doesn't just stop with our toy drive. Throughout the year, you've done so many community things. You've given back so much um, from teachers to families. And that's what it's all about, especially during the holiday season. But throughout the year with Desert Financial Credit Union. Yeah, we volunteered over, our staff volunteered over 14,000 hours wow. in 2022, Brad. And um, I just did the math this morning on the way over here. That's as if we took seven of our staff members and said full time for the next year you're going to do nothing but volunteer at all these community events wow think about that that's amazing that's crazy that is and you know it doesn't just with your employees it's also with the members who are there they're giving back too because that's what desert financial credit union is about it's about family it's about members and everybody participating and giving and you would know brad yeah so thanks for that yeah <laughs> thanks to our four hundred thousand members we really appreciate the support that they give anytime we do fundraising for charitable causes, they step up in a big way. As a matter of fact, we we set a record this year in our fundraising for Phoenix Children's Hospital. Uh, we raised over one million dollars wow. for the first time in 2022. Wow, and we're really proud of that. That's amazing. And what we love too is that out at the. Uh, um, Sue Lights with our veterans. You were there with your volunteers helping out. You even brought family member along too to uh, see what it's all about. I you? did, and I, I think it's important to get our children involved at, at the earliest age possible. Um, they need to see the needs that are out there and, you know, what it means to fulfill those needs. Um, you know, we were able to share dinner with some of the Gold Star families, and, you know, you see the kids, and they're excited. I mean, this is... Uh, the difference between them having a happy holiday and you know, not so happy. Yeah. I'm also happy we were able to help families this year with more than just toys. Yeah. Because it's one thing to give a, a child a toy, but if they're going home to a house where they don't even have a bed to sleep in, that's not so good. Yeah. And so we were able to, I understand, help about 100 families with some household needs uh, throughout the state of Arizona. I love that we did a lot up in northern Arizona this year. Yeah, I was going to bring that up, is that that branch has only been open for two years now. I think mm -hmm. that's it. And you guys have gone gangbuster up there. You just opened a new one in Flagstaff, too. And that's what that, that uh, area is doing, is giving back up there, too, which is so amazing. Yeah, we've become known for that. We're really a part of the communities that we're in. Um, and I think that makes a difference to people. Yeah. And, you know, hopefully if you... People out there haven't joined a credit union, you should check that out because locally owned financial institutions really do care about the communities they operate in. And we only serve Arizona. Yeah. And it's a great feeling. Yeah. And what I love, Jeff, is that you're here in the community. You know you're just not sitting behind your desk. You've stopped into here. You're going out into the community yourself. And and that's what it's about when you see the leader of the credit union doing it, it makes you want to do it too, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. We did, uh, we donated over $100,000 to food banks for their holiday food drives. We did a big turkey drive at Thanksgiving. And, you know, that makes a difference. Yeah. And, you know, I love getting out there with our folks to volunteer and load those turkeys up into trunks. That, that's always a fun event. Yeah. As we wrap up, I have to ask you, what's this mean to you and the Desert Financial Credit Union um, family, we could say. I sometimes say members, but family. What's it mean to you guys to, to be able to do this? Well, first of all, I want to thank AZ7 because it's been great partnering with uh, you all on this event. And I'm always impressed with how you show up and your team shows up and you're present. And you're, you go all in. And I think that's what we try and do. And this was the best one yet. I can't wait for next year. Um, you know, I think the economy is going to be a little rough in 2023. I, I'm sure the needs will be greater than ever. Yeah. And, you know, we want to be there to support that and, and to help out. Oh, well, Jeff, we thank you very much to Desert Financial Credit Union for being a part of this year. Looking forward to having you next year. And, you know, you're always welcome to come in and talk. 
you know, with us about anything that you have going on there. So we appreciate it. Well, we're going to take you up on that, Brad. <laughs> Thanks so much. I love it. And of course, uh, you can go to aztv.com. You can click. We still have our uh, uh, Hometown Heroes toy page up there. You can take a look at all the things we've done over the year um, for this event. And uh, again, it continues on. So um, just keep it right here on AZTV7.